So you want to find shiny Pokemon. I get you. I mean, I love showing off my shiny Pokemon to other people too. I'm, what? Whoa, wait, what? Makes me feel like an early 2000s trophy hunter showing off my prized possessions. But the problem is finding them. I definitely don't have hours upon hours of time to look for these things. So I did all of you a favor. I scoured the interwebs and games to find the best method to find shiny Pokemon. This is the only shiny guide you will need to see as the rest of them are nothing compared to this absolute masterpiece. So without further ado, you gotta go to this website and download this thing. Once you do, open up the application, insert your ROM, set your shiny odds to 100% and bada bing bada boom, you got all the shinies. Now, some of you may be saying that this is cheating and that it is wrong to do in general. But let me present this to you. A quote from 21 Savage himself. I gotta feed the streets. My pistol gon' bleed the streets. Ski mask on my face. Sometimes you gotta cheat. I mean, if this dude says it's okay to cheat, then I'm pretty sure it's okay. So everybody relax. 21 Savage certified. On top of that, if you want to do an additional pro game remove, just claim you found all of these shinies legitimately. I mean, if Dream can cheat and get away with it without any consequences, then I'm pretty sure you can too. Trust me. My only regret about this video is that I didn't release it sooner. If I did, then all of the other Pokemon YouTubers could have just used this method in their shiny videos. It would have saved them a lot of time and let them focus on other things, such as, you know, getting therapy, learning to read, and, you know, maybe Bruh. brainstorming some new video ideas. Thanks to this method, it allowed me to finish this game of Pokemon Ruby in record speed. Which is what I wanted to say, but I, I lied. I didn't even finish the game. During my run, I got all the way up to the part where you do the double battle with Steven Stone. And then the game crashed and I couldn't continue. It's probably because the game can't make Steven's Pokemon shiny in this double battle and the game won't let the battle happen, you know, which won't let me continue playing the game. So if you do plan on using this method, maybe change the shiny ratio to 99% instead of 100 so maybe you could actually play the game. You know, just a thought. And listen, if you want more life-changing tips like these in the future, consider subscribing to my channel. Like, I'll, listen, I'll give you better advice than your therapist, so you, you gotta come back. Alright, that's all I got for you guys today. Uh, I just want to wish you a happy holidays and all the best for the new year.